Welcome back everyone. Sorry about the technical issues there, but as you can see we up in the mountains just like we were hoping for. These lions have come out. They are moving around slowly. Have you still can you still see them there, Marcel? Okay, let me just I just want to move the vehicle back about a meter or two. They keep moving around on these rocks. Oh, wait. They keep moving around on these rocks. But I'm sure you can see there those tiny little cubs. These are the same ones we saw last night. And this is part of a pride called the Mountain Pride. Morning Sophie from Singapore. Um, welcome and thank you for watching. These little cubs, there are five of them. I think we can only see about two of them for now, but they're all running around the rocks. And um, they are in the region of about maximum three months old, possibly even just less than that. They're still very, very small. And as you can see, big, like fluffy ears. So they're still very, very young. And it's only the... Um, well, last night was the second time I had seen them, and this is now the third time I've seen these little cubs, so they're still very, very young. I can't see where the adults have gone, the lionesses. Uh, uh, see, can you see them lying on the rock there, Marcel? Mm -hmm. Can you? Have you got a view? Okay. I can move back a bit if you want. Let me just go back about a meter or so. Okay, there we go. So we've got a perfect view of these little lions on the tree, on the, on the tree, on the rock now. <clears throat> okay, so that, that lioness that you can see on the right hand side is the younger of the two. There's two mothers here. And then the two little cubs next to her must be hers. Wow, this is so special to see. Where these cubs were born is actually about maybe two kilometers away from here. But since about three weeks ago, they seem to the lionesses seem to have moved the cubs up on top of this mountain where they are quite well hidden and safe when the females go off hunting. Up in these rocks there's lots of little crevices and holes in the rocks and also quite a lot of trees as you can see. So there's lots of hiding places for them. Hello Jasmine, um, that is a very good question, which animal sleeps the latest out here where we are? And there's, there's, <laughs> there's something like, yeah, I suppose this time of the year there's a lot of reptiles that will hibernate and sleep almost the whole of the winter um, because of the cold, but out of the big animals that we see, probably rhinos, especially on cold and slightly windy mornings like this one. Um, you might, you'll often see rhinos lying in, in lots of trees where they're a bit covered and they'll sometimes rest there until the sun comes up late in the morning at maybe nine o'clock or so in the morning and it starts warming up. So out of the bigger animals, probably rhinos. That's a really interesting question though. <laughs> 